Hi, thank you for watching Practical Pearls. This is Ashley Tambrin. The title of my Practical Pearls today is A plus B equals C. And that's basically because I always use that phrase, I guess, when talking to people. I think that people have different situations that come up in their life and it's curious to them as to how it happened. Like, why is this happening to me? But really, from an outside perspective, you're watching and going, okay, well, you did this, this happened, and therefore it equals this. Our life is a sum total of decisions we make. And I understand that there's outside things that occur. There's circumstances that you can't control. I'm not, you know, being ridiculous. But for the most part, every decision we make has a repercussion. What goes up must come down. In saying that, I, I think it's interesting that people walk around and it's like they eat junk food and it's like, why am I fat? I don't know. I do this. I do this constantly. Why am I retaining water? Maybe it's because I ate pizza at 12 a.m. Hmm, no, no, that's not it. No, sorry, that couldn't be it. <laughs> um, or, you know, God, I'm so sick. Why did I get cancer? You know, why did I get so sick? Well, maybe it's because of all the toxins and all of the stuff that we ingest. And I'm not trying to sound all hippy-dippy on you, okay? I have tried to fight the, you know, natural law of things for a long time. I'm not the person that buys all organic or, you know, goes way over the top. But honestly, the more I live and the more that I just see the repercussions of what happens when we ingest bad things, the more that it's like, okay, I'm willing to spend $30 on a carton of eggs. I mean, that's, of course that's inflated, but it's true because we ingest all these things and then we're shocked when we're sick. A bad situation happens, we get in trouble uh, because of something that we do habitually. Maybe we drink and drive. Maybe we text and drive. Mm. Don't tell. <laughs> or maybe we, you know, do other things and then we get in trouble and it's like, oh, well, it was just that circumstance. It was just that rare thing. You know, all these are instances where A plus B equals C. You do X, you get, you know, Y effect, and then, you know, it equals problems in our lives. And so a lot of times for people, I just tell them, why don't you break down your behaviors? Really begin to take apart the habits you have on a daily basis. Your daily habits reflect your entire life. I heard it put this one way by Krista Black Gifford, one of my mentors. She said, the condition of your heart is the quality of your life, the condition of your life. And it's true. So I just wanted to give you some food for thought. I wanted you to maybe break down some of your actions. You know what I mean? Problems in your marriage, problems with your kids, you know, problems with your job. Some of these same things you keep facing over and over again. Try to look at it mathematically. Try to go back and see the things that you, you know, your habits, the things that you're doing every day. And I think that you'll come up with some solutions because honestly, the recipe for madness is doing the exact same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. So that for me has changed me going, okay, what am I doing over and over and over again, expecting it to be different every day and it's not. So change it up, do something different, watch something different, start your morning out different, start your morning out meditating. And I know that sounds guru and that's not you in your bathroom like, oh, just taking some time to prep yourself for the day. I'm gonna have a good day. Things are going to be different today. I'm going to forgive today. I'm going to be kind today. You know, I'm, I'm gonna move forward in a new way. Just even that, five minutes of, of a positive meditation can take you in a new direction. Handle a situation differently and see how it affects you. So anyway, that's all I have to say today. A plus B equals C. Have a good day, thanks for watching.